what is up slime pack pack nation y'all can see i'm not at a truck stop but getting ready to leave home base and hit the road i had a good dope idea for how i wanted to do my video coming back on the road but as y'all can see it's starting to rain and it's kind of gonna get in the way of my ideal i hate when it rains but i picked me up a new gopro i finally got the 360 i've been wanting this camera for like a year finally got it for um black friday deals and uh later on in this video i'm gonna show y'all what all i got so make sure y'all like this video subscribe if you haven't already subscribed leave a comment after the video is over with and we're about to go pick this load up y'all surprisingly i got this pre-planned on a friday afternoon and the low i had got a message that the low was already preloaded yesterday so i really could have went and got this low yesterday but uh my home time wasn't gonna be over until the day so i just enjoyed my last day and now i'm getting ready to hit the road and i'll see y'all when we get over there to pick up this load <clears throat> Just arrived here 20 minutes later. How you doing, by the way? All right. All right, you pop that door for me? Yes, sir. I appreciate it. You have a great day. You too. Have a good night. I'm going to try to. It's going to be a long drive. I hope you drive safe. I will. <laughs> you be safe also. Always. Let me do my arrive location, yeah, yeah. 28, drop trailer. No, I ain't connected to no trailer. We good. Got to slide them tandems. Dang, Chucker B, if you watching this video, I thought that was you for a second. But I'm pretty sure you still ain't left the house yet. All right, so I already know what trailer I'm looking for. So while I'm riding around here to head to the back, I'm going to try to see if I'm going to pass by the trailer. So once I get my paperwork, I can just hook up and get up out of here. My cousin actually works here at the Smithfield. And if this if they hadn't sent me a notification that this load was ready i was probably gonna send him that text and be like hey you know this is my load can you go ahead and get me ready but luckily we already ready okay so i found my trailer but i was gonna hook up to it oh it stinks i didn't want to get caught in the rain it's all the way back around that way so yeah i'm trying to be hooked up and out of here within 15 minutes i know i can get hooked up to my trailer but it depends on how long they take to answer the phone for the live dispatch all right so we hooked up it's been a total of six minutes
rain starting to pick up. Alright, just slid the tandem, so hopefully we in a good spot at the back. I think I may have slid it too far up, but we'll see. to but still gonna keep these positive eyes and get this load delivered i'm about to go across the scale i'm sure you know this is not uh you know a positive estimate but i just want to you know make sure my gauges is kind of lining up with what they scale is saying so i'll be good Lining up pretty good to me. Now it's time to hit this road. My fuel stop is in Charlotte. Hopefully, we make it. I'm about 200 something miles away from Charlotte. I'm not sure if I'm gonna fill all the way up or what. I figure that out whenever I get over there. So I just got here to my fuel stop, which is the Love 714, I think so. Here in Charlotte, I got about 60 gallons of fuel, 60 or 66. And they got me somewhere around like, I can get 500 miles off of that. I'm only, let me see. I'm only 250 miles, 51 miles away from my 90. And where I'm delivering to, there's like, no fuel stations within our network that's close by so i got enough fuel in here to complete this trip and to give me a head start on my next trip i should get over there around like four in the morning mm, maybe maybe two and my appointment ain't until 8 30 in the morning so hopefully they can unload me early and i can get up out of there so I finally arrived here at the receiver. I ended up taking me a little split, y'all. I shut down for about three hours because I got sleepy. I'm still early for this delivery. I was supposed to have been here if I hadn't shut down around like 2.30, 3 a.m. But now it is currently 6.20 and y'all, I want to show y'all something like this. It is not me, but uh, this is what procrastinating do. I told myself whenever I come home, I'm gonna get everything on the truck and situated the day before I leave. Cause the day that I leave, I usually always just throw everything in here and it's just a mess. I really didn't, I put up all my groceries and stuff, but now I did laundry at home. So I got to put up all my clothes. 
um i got a lot more electronics i'm gonna show y'all that and my grandma had bought me this bag like that bag was good i got all my little electronics and gadgets in there but i'm gonna show y'all that in a second let me get this together so i got the gopro the gopro max 360 ready to shoot some content on that then I got the iPhone 15, brand new iPhone. I'm recording on my 12 Pro Max right now. So I've been having this phone for at least a good three to four years, and it's been doing good. I got a new, whenever people ask me, how do I get the um, angle view of me backing? This is what I mean by a wrist mount. This is the mount that you wrap around your wrist, but I wrap it around the mirror. And I bought this, this is a little extended arm because i want to like a, a higher position for my camera to sit up higher so i've been having this this is how i get the angle views of like kind of like how you can see the truck driving behind the wheels and stuff like that this is magnetic and i just stick it on and it's very strong it's real strong this is my gopro 11 you know that's the head mount and then this is honestly I think this is another wrist mount. Yeah, I think so. I got some more lights. I got some extra batteries for the GoPro. Hold on. Yeah, I got extra batteries for the 360 GoPro. I think this is three. I think I got that for like a Black Friday sale for, I think $15. And this is a mount that I'm gonna stick to like the side of the headrest. It's really a motorcycle bracket, but I figured out another spot where it can go. And really that's about all I did. So yeah, I'm ready to get a little better content for y'all. And this right here gonna be my bag for my electronics. I keep plenty of these. So yeah, yeah I'm still here waiting on this load. I did put up some lights already. Don't want to do too much. I do got some on the back of my tube, but I got them cut off. But yeah, yeah, I got my little section together so far. About to um, eat me a banana with some yogurt. I got some granola and just chill until they call me.
two days since I've been in the truck. So I'm gonna come over here and crank it up. I need to get some sneakers out of here. All right, everything is good and let the truck run for about a good 10, 12 minutes. Now it's time to go do some shopping, y'all. It's been raining since I've been home, but I'm getting ready to get out here and do some shopping. It is Thanksgiving Eve. And I'm about to go catch these Black Friday sales before the actual Black Friday people come. Okay, y'all. So I just made it to Best Buy and I'm about to treat myself. I've been working hard, been grinding hard, and I've been wanting something for like a year now. And I see they got it on sale. It's like $150 less than the actual price. And hopefully it's not gone. We're about to go in here and get it. Which I think it is. They got these TVs stocked up and ready to go. They better have my stuff stocked up. And they got TVs bought on every single aisle. I really, I really want this right here. This thing right here is bad. The quality on it is perfect. But y'all see that price? No, no. I got it, but I ain't got it to spend on that. But this is what I call for. I'm finally gonna get the 360. They was $4.99, but they is $349. So that's definitely a deal. They even like the price of the 12 is $349. They got the GoPro 11s for $299. And the 11 Mini for $249. And the GoPro 9 for $199. But definitely about to get this. Yes. Right here. I'm gonna go ahead and bring this up to the front for you. And okay. Whenever you're ready, it'll be okay for you. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. And they got so many more on different aisles, y'all. They stopped up and ready. But uh, we up in here early. They got that copyright turn all the way up, so I'm gonna try to just hurry up. But um, I see they got the SD cards. They say the Sam Samsung ones is good, but uh, they got no prices on it. If the prices ain't good, then I'm gonna just stick with what I'm gonna what I'm gonna get. What I usually get is from Walmart. And the TVs just keep going and going. Y'all don't have to wait till Thanksgiving night or Friday. There's so many TVs just everywhere. If somebody needed a TV for Christmas, I would get one, but um. And also, I need a new phone, y'all. I'm still rocking out with the iPhone 12 Pro Max. So, I think I'm gonna order the um, 15 Plus. I usually get the Max, but I mean, the price difference in the Max. Only thing different is just the camera lens. You got three camera lens with this one, and you get only two with this one, but the quality's still good. But I'm gonna order mine. From T-Mobile. I ain't gonna buy it from here. 